What is going on, y'all? Ooh, prosperity is out there on the deck. I was just about to put it back. The spirit said there's a message in that. Prosperity. Welcome, cross watchers and newbies, divine masculines, divine feminines, and even the karmics. Okay, because <laughs> we know you're here. <laughs> so, prosperity. Okay. Know that you deserve all things wondrous and believe you can have them. Um, best email is best email. What the hell is she talking about? Oh, I'm getting a message right now from probably a future client. Um, <laughs> but anyway, so let's see what, ooh, inspiration, prosperity, prosperity and inspiration right now. These cards are so cute, guys. Look at them. They're so colorful and so witchy and so vital. It, it's so cute. Um... An inspired mind is willing to reach beyond limitations. I just got this card on TikTok as well. So there's a message definitely in this. Spirit, what are we talking here about this insp inspiration card? What is this inspiration card, Spirit? I'm taking, I'm taking all of these. No. Tender embrace. The land between. Quieting the mind. And tender embrace. Okay, so what we have here is prosperity, inspiration, quieting the mind, tender embrace. This is always giving me self love. I don't know why. It's just as it currently is. I think everybody needs a little bit more self love, right? Um, and quieting the mind. I don't think necessarily you can quiet the mind. I seen a TikTok a long time ago that said, you don't meditate to quiet your mind. You meditate to weed through all the bullshit to, you know, get messages through all the jumbledness and shit like that. Cause you can never quiet your mind. If somebody tell you they can quiet their mind. I think they a liar because y'all don't think you sure. The brain is is an ever-moving, growing, whatever the fuck, you know, muscle that just keep constantly being used. It even works while you sleep. How you can how can you say, I don't be thinking because I be meditating? Yes, yeah, the fuck you do. It's just the point that you think in a different way now. You think in a different perspective now. You think and you, you have weeded through the bullshit. You have weeded through ego, shadow self, other voices in your head. You have weeded through, you know, shit like that. And this is on some non-schizophrenic shit. I also think those labels, we ain't even gonna talk about that. Anyway, so what I was saying though, is when you quiet the mind, you're really quieting through the bullshit to weed through the bullshit and, and get rid of certain things that you don't need, right? In your space, your aura. This is why they say meditate because if you clear your mind and quiet your mind, you can literally get messages and, and, and clarity on situations around you, inside of you, and stuff like that, right? At the end of the day, I don't know why I'm putting on my evil eye right now. That's weird. Somebody sending me negative energy right now. Yes, but you don't need the evil eye. It's just an instinct. Oh, it was an instinct because one of these bitches is on my videos. Spirit said, bada bing, bada boom. I know I'm in tune. <laughs> but uh, uh, that was so weird, y'all. That was so weird. I randomly just started to grab my damn. But I already know I don't really need none of these fucking shits. But I feel like one of these damn stones is really helping my motherfucking um third eye or so i think it's this Louis livis i learned a word one of my uh subscribers you guys helped me out like yesterday with the word but it actually helps you to help your third eye but that was so fucking weird i literally stopped that and grabbed that okay um it's just a bitch sending me um uh, negative energy and also if you do weird shit like that i call it weird but it really ain't it's instinct if you do stuff like that it's because it it it's a reason for it, not just, especially if you was just in, in the zone of talking about something. Y'all see how I was just in the zone of talking about something, right? And boom, there it is. Like, take heed to that spirit of saying, it's not just you and your urges. It's not just you, oh, let me put on this ring because it's my favorite ring. No, it's literally probably out of protection. And now all I feel is nothing but tingling on this arm. Like, it got to be this damn stone here. Let me see if 
take it off. I still feel it, but it's this one. Spirit said, yes, we tried to tell you that. Which, what is this one? It's magnetic. I can tell you that. Why did it do that? Look at that, y'all. That's weird. Spirit, is it fake? Spirit says some of them are. What? I'm confused. Interesting, y'all. What the hell stone is this? Is this just for like... I keep hearing sm smoky quartz. Why do I keep hearing that? Um, What stone is this, y'all? I got this yesterday at the, the witch shop. But it tingles. It definitely tingles. I feel it. I don't know. But it's just not an instinct, y'all. I mean, oof, child. I'm thinking about some whole other shit. It is an instinct to just go and protect, right? Just like if your baby was doing something like choking or something, it's an instinct to, to hurry up and try to, uh, you know, stop your kid from choking and, and, and watching. It's just instinct. You already know to do it. So I don't know who this is for, but in that moment, when you feel things, Spirit is saying, listen to your gut. Stop going down wrong road. Stop turning down wrong corners. Stop going to the wrong fork in the road. Because honestly, at the end of the day, it's the wrong fucking way. And y'all know when I get in the rhyme and I get in the motherfucking chime, and y'all. Like, let's go. If you don't catch me on YouTube, um, definitely hit up TikTok. Because I have a lot of platforms that I'm trying to still build and grow. And it consumes a lot of my time. This is why I took a break from the readings. Because I also need to do my Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine um, Oracle. I still need to do my Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine Oracle cards. I still haven't finished that. I've just been getting bombarded with readings. I love all of you guys who fuck with my energy and want readings from me. Yes, I do. I love you. But I kind of need to take a break. Right? I can do collectives. But personally channeling right now. I'll say I'll start doing that again uh, Monday. Just let me get some things in order because, baby, I can get busy. I mean, I can get busy to where I'm doing it all day long. And by the time I look at the clock, it's fucking 6 o'clock and I ain't ate shit. Because I'm in between readings trying to upload on YouTube. I'm in between readings trying to do something on TikTok. Because it'd it be people on TikTok. Where is she at? I wonder where she at. Is she going live? it be y'all on YouTube. When When she ever going to go live? When is the video? Y'all got y'all notifications on. I mean, I love y'all. I fucks y'all. But please, <laughs> let me get a system going. You know, when you first start out in your business, right? Look, look. This is a message. This is a message. I got chills on that. This is a message at hand, right? To quiet the mind. Ooh, spirit, we is on point. Let's go. To quiet the mind, you must take a step back and embrace your motherfucking self. You got the inspiration. You got the prosperity. When you're going to take time out to quiet your fucking mind? And spirit said, there it is then. And I know when y'all like, I'll, I'll uh, use my pendulum. Spirit, is that what this is? Yes, right on the money. Take time to rest, rejuvenate, relax. The fuck? I'm telling y'all, that's that's exactly what this reading is about. Look, bottom of the deck, a burst, a burst of magic. It was in reverse, honestly. A burst of magic because you keep see beyond what you what you consume your life with. They say top of the deck. Look at this. See what you consume. Your Look beyond that shit. Look at a higher view. What do you need to tackle right now so you can be a better you? What do you need to pull back from? Pull your energy back so you can be focused more and know and to what to execute. And that's on TikTok notification, y'all. Just because we have busy lives. I don't give a fuck. You got kids. Kids and babies come first, of course. But sometimes, mommies, daddies, you have to put yourself first. How can you not put yourself first? And then try to put your kid first. When that been when basically ain't none of y'all first. You have to sort of take a take a step back to recharge, okay? To recharge a little bit and 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 get a little quiet space. I know it may be hard. I know for some of y'all finna be like it's it's hard as fuck being a single parent. What do we woo? Or I just ain't got the time to do it. Look, you can do this shit in the shower when you're taking a shower. Meditate in the shower. That is your moment to do so in the shower. When you when you're drinking your coffee in the morning, that is a moment for you to get in tune with yourself, to know, to to get inspired, to also see what you gotta um do but also quiet your mind it's the everyday 
little things that we do that to where we can meditate at that same time. The little shit that you do, you peeling a banana for your kid. Meditate at that that fucking 30 seconds for you to just go off into space, stare, but still handling your shit, still being aware. But y'all know what I mean now. Come on, y'all know when you you start to um let's just say I start to shuffle my cards right now and I just blank out and I start staring. Okay? It's like a form of disassociation. Spirit saying it's not like a form it is. I got disassociation. Damn. What the fuck is that? <laughs> well, look, look, look. They said no, but people do. Do I got disassociate? Disassociate? Okay. Let me. <laughs> Shit. I need to get checked. Oh, I'm just saying. But anyway, it's like a form of disassociation. It was what Spirit is saying, right? It's like a form of meditation. It's like. You literally start to stare and you, you, it's like a focusing at that moment. And then someone be like, Hey, you paying attention to a, hey, and you heard every fucking word they were saying, but you were in that moment of quietness. Just like that. It happens just like that quietness. And you hear and see everything around you, but you just focused on a quiet moment. You ever seen a commercial with the moms? She's drinking coffee. Kids is running wild as hell. And she had a moment of quiet. She just, y'all y'all heard the ring. You hear the ringing first and then it just all of a sudden, just everything just shh. This is what you guys need to do. Okay. All right, y'all. So I have forgot what I was saying before I, before I had paused the video. I wanted to go do something. Um, at the end of the day, I think we all need to take time for self. Okay. We know we prosperous. We know prosperity is coming in. We're so fucking inspired, but we're really, really, really jumbled and, and needing a break. Yes. The money is good. Yes. Growing your business is good. Yes, doing everything and being busy and shit is good. But when are you going to take time out for you? When are you going to take time to pause and get you together? How can you be the best version of what you're supposed to be doing? And you're not taking care of you. This is why they say you come first no matter what. You cannot ever in your life try to put someone else first and you feel like shit. You sick you tired just anything and you over here trying to put everybody else first right how don't you need to kind of take it back a little bit and for the for some of the parents i know it may be a little different and uh, difficult for you but you're gonna have to try to find that's that little piece 22 32 48 is significant here could be somebody's birthday You could be 22, 32, or 48 with three kids. One's an eight-year-old. Anything like that, right? Um, or close to that age. You guys are needing to find balance within yourself and what you need to handle that's around you. Um, this is a weird color, my mood ring, huh? But you need to find balance, okay? Because if you're not balanced and everything else around you isn't balanced, if you're not okay, then you trying to uh, raise your kids and all that other shit, go to work, then that situation won't be okay. Then now you're more overwhelmed and stressed because now you feel like a bad parent. Or now you feel like it's just some crazy shit. You need to quiet your mind. Someone is really in their mind. Not knowing what the fuck to do. Not taking time out for self, even if it's a, like a little bath. Like, it can be a bath for like 10 minutes, right? While the kids are playing or something. This is for moms. This is especially for parents right now. Spirit is saying, yes, you guys are wrecking havoc on your own lives. Okay? Don't take that the wrong way. But y'all know what the hell I'm saying when I say it. You're not taking time out for self. Even if it's, what if it's driving the kids to school, right? You can meditate when you're going back home. Hell, do something. Look, bearing fruit. 
You need to water your own tree to so that fruit look and shine through. Some of you guys' lights are very, very, very dim. Okay? Because you're you're giving your energy to stuff that is actually needed, but stuff that actually is not. I think you guys need to take time to sit and figure out how can you get serenity if it is for two minutes. Spirit, let's do a card. And this is why I think I have closed my shop until Monday. Look, you are good enough to take time for yourself, bro. I, I refuse. I, re I refuse to be running ragged and shit just because people need reads. Okay, I appreciate you, but bro, I come first. And if I feel like I need to pull back my energy to regain my energy and come back stronger than ever, then that's what the hell I'm going to do. And if you don't understand that, then you can't fuck with me. And that's just what it is. And that's for a message for everybody else. When you pull your energy back from certain people or things and situations um, and they get mad at you because you have, they don't really fuck with you. They should understand that you need to pull your damn energy back so you can recharge and be better and be stronger and come back. Okay. At the end of the day, we need time for self. Put self first. Fuck everybody else. And this is why my shop is closed until Monday.